hi friends in this video we are going to see how to give this shaft shaft is nothing but the cylindrical object so already we have created this axis system in this video i will tell you the advantage of access system created by the point so by default i have created one plane and just i'm hiding it i'm going to start my sketch so how i want to keep my part and just i want to have my part in z direction vertically and i want to keep my part create my part in cy plane so i am clicking this one my sketch profile is like vertical in here and horizontal here if you want you can swap it here so here i am giving projected point as the point so that whenever i am moving this point by default my sketch also will be correlated to that one so this orientation this one by default it is complete coming implicit you can keep as same no need to change anything here so i'm giving okay so now i need to create my profile for creating this profile i am taking I'm removing this material, sorry, line here. Creating with one reference line. So I'm going to give this reference line as the axis of rotation to my path. In this one, just I want to add one chamfer. So my chamfer is coming as a reference line. I'm changing it. This value we can have the control. So whatever it is default, it is created with 45 degree <coughs> and this dimension it is taking from this edge. So my sketch is done. I'm going to exit from the sketch and I'm going to give the sketch based feature shaft. So I am selecting this sketch and giving the axis. I am taking, if you want you can give this axis, otherwise you can give the C as the axis of rotation. <coughs> so that your profile has been created. So nothing but this is the shaft. So once you added the material, then only this uh, removing material operations will be highlighted. The same way you can remove the material in the operation using group. So here what I am going to do is like I am going to create a shell kind of just reducing this material thickness so I'm just selecting this I'm 
annoyance. So because of this constraint, it is showing over constraint. So the pink color is over constraint. I need to so here we have trim option. Just I'm trimming this excess material. So, what are the sketch I have created here? I'm just changing as a constraint construction line. Once your sketch is done, just exit from the sketch or bench. So we have created this in the profile. So I am going to give this grow option by selecting this. So now that material was removed inside this part. But you are not able to see this from the bottom. Is that a, if this one is not a manufacturable part? So for this scenario only we are by instead of doing two operation we can do it in one single operation just by creating whatever the default thickness value you want you can give it and just give the remove material surface so that you can have this shell thickened part so the same operation we can use this under sub feature and we can do it in a less survey so most of the cases we are going for this shell operation in this scenario like if you are removing material with the uniform thickness you can use the cell option So next we will see the rib. For rib you need a guiding profile and, and profile. So I am going to edit this. Selecting all and deleting. So I am going to create my profile. Just I am creating one simple circular profile.
giving the value of 10. So whatever the profile you created and the guide uh, line should be, guide profile should be perpendicular to your profile sketch. So perpendicular to this profile. Just I'm creating one single line. So now we have the sketch page to future. So profile you need to select and then center curve. Center curve is nothing but your guiding profile. So here we have two options merge rips end. So if you have any future here and if you select that feature by default it will merge with that future. So pulling direction you can change the pulling direction and reference surface according to reference surface this profile will control keep angle so by default keep angle will be there so we can also follow the same and as per your requirement we can do this pulling direction for pulling direction you can give by default direction x so this is your pulling direction so you can give x The same way you need to create a for the slot same profile you need to follow and it is going to remove the material thanks for watching my video the remaining sketch based features we will see in our next upcoming video thanks for watching my video